we had to treat ourselves to one jacket real quick for the before we before we get financially responsible, you know. Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Hope you're feeling good, man. Finally, a little bit better, man. That cold really wiped me out last week. Like I was done for, I hope. And let me just tell you, wash your hands, wash your booty, stay clean, okay? Don't get sick. I don't get sick like that. And all of a sudden I was like dead last week, but we back. And I wanna make this video short, straight, sweet to the point. Wait, short, sweet, I don't even know, whatever. But yeah, anyway. <laughs> Uh, obviously another Stone Island pickup, I guess you could say, but I also want to just go over some sizing. And I've done this previously in the past, kind of like the t-shirts, the jeans, I think I did the pants, I'm not 100% sure, but I want to do the outerwear because for what you're paying for, it really sucks when you don't have like a Stone Island in your area. If you don't live in New York or Japan or Los Angeles, you, you don't got Stony in your area, right? So you just got to guesstimate and hope for the best. And sometimes when you get it on sale, you don't want to get the wrong size because then you return it and then you can't get what you got. You know what I'm saying? If that makes any sense at all. So, bro, I just thought the weather was clearing up, but Bodega had this phenomenal sale. They have it every year and I was waiting because I've been wanting to get one of these jackets. You guys remember, uh, I had like an ice jacket earlier, like sometime last year and it was too small, it was extra large. That guy in a little coat. That guy in a little coat. Don't sleep. We had the 2XL, boys. This jacket retails for $853. It's a real down jacket. Like I said, it is a 2X. Uh, let me give you, you know what I'm saying? You peep the details for the one time. This jacket is super hard. And I feel like orange just isn't, it isn't it, right? So I knew for a fact, number one, this would be tough to sell. And number two, 2X. Not very many people are buying a 2X. So. I'm 6'3", 100 and maybe 200 pounds now, but let's, let's see what's good. You know what I like about this is, it is still snowing here in Colorado. Weather is just back and forth. Sometimes it just gets really chilly. So yeah, it fits perfect. Like I said, the XL was just too short on the sleeves, but this is a nice jacket. Like, wow. I'm talking about, and like I said, I got this 80% off. Like this was the last of the last. Usually Bodega does like 40% off, then they do 50, and then they do 60, 70, all the way until they liquidate whatever it is that they're trying to get rid of. And I just knew. I knew if I was patient, I was gonna get this jacket for a good deal. Oh word, we even got another button in the pocket. So, yeah man, I'm very happy with this. Like I said, I just suggest sizing up. For the majority of the time, I would wear an XL and a jacket. So just size up, I think that's your best bet. And I know it is getting a little hot out, but just being here, the weather changes, bro. In the morning, it's a blizzard and in the afternoon it's 80 degrees and it just keeps repeating so very very happy to pick these up especially i'm about to wear these with the royal ones like the blue and orange looks crazy perfect color blocking and just to show you guys what i'm talking about as far as the, sh the sleeves being too short so i got this jacket a while ago this is the ice jacket this actually changed colors uh when it's cold out you put some heat to it you can see like the sleeves are just you know what i'm saying sleeves are too short but i mean it still fits like if you want a really snug fit ain't nothing wrong with going with your true size it's just i mean how many people like their jackets just super tight you know what i'm saying like it's just not it i actually have this jacket for sale i mean this, this jacket's still tough but it's just too damn small like i said these are i'm trying to tell you guys this ahead of time that way you don't spend $900 on a jacket and it doesn't even fit you. Even though we ain't spending $900 on a jacket because we ain't stupid, we, we wait till it discounts, but you know what I'm saying. The next outerwear piece we'll get into is actually my nylon metal, I guess top, crew neck, whatever you want to call it. Now this is an XL. This is where it gets interesting, right? For the most part, you typically want crew necks to just kind of fit, right? be decently fitted a little bit oversized so this fits perfect and that's what i'm saying like the sizing is just so irregular you just never know what to expect but this is just an xl like typically in a crew neck i would usually get a large because i like it a little bit fitted but you know this is an xl and it fits very nice i'm comfortable sleeve length is there and bublam you know now let's get into this next piece this is old super old piece but it is a denim jacket and it's relatively what their fit is always gonna be with denim jackets. They don't release denim jackets too often, but you know, just in case the opportunity arises and you see one, this is an extra large. I think this fits 
perfect. That perfect size for I could just wear a t-shirt under it, but I could also wear a hoodie if I wanted to. Very versatile. I like the sizing on this. Again, sleeves are right there. So I would say as far as denim jackets go, go true to size. If I went with a large, it would be a little bit more snug and more of that kind of fitted look. But I mean, I like my denim jackets just a little bit loose. Puppy boys for the one time. And then last but not least is the shadow project. The outer piece that I wanted to get into. I think the majority of people typically buy hoodies or crew necks, also an extra large. But the thing about the shadow project collection is typically it runs big. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's definitely a looser fit. Now for the majority of Stone Island hoodies, I have an extra large of just the standard, but you know, that's kind of like the style and the look of it. It's typically what you'd see, you know, your basic stony piece, very basic, straight to the point, and then obviously the patch on the side. But like I said, this is an extra large, and boy is this tight. And man, this thing is OD tight, bro. Now, I mean, it don't look as tight right now, but I, let me just put it this way, if you skinny, you should be good, right? But if you got a little belly or a little bit bigger dude, like 6'6 six, six or something like that, it might be tough. I would definitely get a 2X. Hey man, I've been in the gym. Like two months ago, my belly was like, ba blam it was a little gut, so it was super tight, but it's not as tight right now, so. Weight just changes with the seasons, man. I really could have just answered this in the beginning of the video, it's simple. If you wanna pick up any Stone Island pieces of outerwear, the majority of the time you need to size up. That's just the way it is. You won't regret it, it won't be too tight. And of course, I just wanted to show you guys this fire jacket, bro. I was like super proud of myself, which, I mean, this was before I started making wise financial decisions, you know what I'm saying? But we had to treat ourselves to one jacket real quick for the, before we, before we get financially responsible, you know. Yeah, man, I just wanted to see what you guys thought of it because I thought this jacket was super tough, bro. I wish it was black, just because obviously I could wear it for a lifetime. But the greatest thing about buying these Stone Island pieces, I know that I've been selling a lot of my stuff. I've worn a lot of stuff and been able to sell it for more than I paid for it. So that's why it's always great to wait for a deal. And of course, I'm going to plug the Twitter page that I own, Deals Under Cost, you guys can go check. Always tweeting out deals every single day, or you can follow a Sneaker Life. If you follow Sneaker Life on Twitter, there's always sneaker deals. So many great deals, man. No reason to pay full price. I mean, we could all be fresh, bro, for discounted. We ain't gotta pay crazy money, you know? Just patience saves pockets. No, these two don't, don't match right now, but. There you guys have it, man. Just size up. Let me know if any of you guys own any Stone Island or if you're interested in it. I get these comments from the top boys in London like, hey, man, you ain't no whatever y'all be calling me. I'm American, bro. I, I, can't, I can't like Stone Island too. Well, I do. And I'm telling people what sizes to wear, so ha. There you guys have it. This is your boy, Sneaker Life. I'll catch you in the next one. Run it. Hands in the air now.